Learning to ride a bike has its challenges. Why is that bee keep following me? But for four-year-old Brinley Henches, he wants to sting me. The bee wasn't the hardest part. She had a fall on her bike. She was not very comfortable on it. It was a really old one. Which is what brought the family to the Cambridge Walmart Monday night, where they planned to buy the bike you see Brinley sitting on. The man in front of them had other plans. My husband decided to let this other man go ahead of him because he just had a few items. The guy was just kind of like smiling at our kids and stuff. Yeah, when we got up to pay, she said to us, don't worry about it, that guy paid for your stuff. And we were like, what? And she said, yeah, he just gave me $180 for your stuff. I like that it has pom-poms on the end of it. The money covered the bike, the unicorn helmet, and everything else in their cart with $40 left over. And my husband's like, well, we'll pay it forward. And he gave the, change, gave the money to uh, the girl behind us. I want to say thank you. The family never got a chance to say that in person. I didn't even see the guy's face. So he was long gone. They hope they can find him and thank him for what he did. Good job, keep going. Until then, they're grateful. Push, you can do it. That learning to ride a bike Push. came with a lesson in kindness. Really happy to show our daughter that, see there's really nice people out there like that, that they're just, they have big hearts. In Cambridge, Jennifer Austin, CARE 11 News.